Oh, low, medium, high. I get it. What did it default to? Is this a save game? No, it's a password game. Default, which I think was easy. Yeah. Credits. Guess I go this way. Okay. No. Mini games. Is that all this is? Is a mini game game? Story mode, there we go. What a confusing. My name is Shaman Mayanmam Yumbo. This is the story of a girl, Eliza, who travels the world with her parents, Nigel and Marianne. She has a sister, Debbie, an adopted wild child brother, Donnie, and a chimpanzee, Darwin. Gave Eliza, hello, gamer. Gave Eliza a special gift, so she had the power to speak to animals. Someday Eliza will do great things with this gift. Let's join Eliza on her adventure at helping to rescue animals from evil poachers. It all begins in the Serengeti Plain in the wilds of Africa. Um, uh -huh. This is the only one open. Save the cheetah cubs. Alright, level one. Save the cheetah cubs. Well, this is already different than the other game. I think this is a minigame game. Do I give him to the helicopter? Yeah. Go for that elephant. Maybe I got crushed. Yep, Daystream. It's a little slow today, so I thought I'd give it a stream. Oh. I'm saving them from the helicopter? I guess I have to wait. sure what the boxes do. Well, this is a mini game game. I am doing one tonight too as well, yeah. I've been trying to do more day streams. Maybe next time. Try it again. So I don't think this game's gonna take too long if it's a mini game game. those boxes do. Maybe they heal you. It's definitely a flower petal. Boxes don't heal you. There we go. I did it. ADJ7. Yeah, it's a cartoon based on uh, Wild Thorn Berries. Yeah, it's a Nicktoon. Thank you. Next one. Rescue Eliza. I am Eliza. Wow, 
I see. Avoid obstacles. Like that one. far so easy. Running out of time, though. I think I've watched one or two episodes. This one's actually based on the movie, which is based on the uh, cartoon. Oh. Might make it. Didn't make it. I was waiting for her to drop and she never did. Hmm. Try it again. I can hit shrubs, I just can't hit trees. Maybe I have to stay underneath her for a certain amount of time. I don't think I'm going to make it this time. These mini games aren't bad. System tier stuff. Looks like this has more competent driving than Thunder Alley. It does have more competent Thunder uh, than uh, driving. Yeah, that was a one out of five game. It was just kicking for five hours. I don't see how I could have hit anything less than a one. It was absolutely it's a boring, horrible game. I haven't seen what the B button does yet. I have not played Samurai Jack. I liked the cartoon back when it was on. Aren't they making the new Samurai Jack game? There's something about Samurai Jack coming back. Just my death counter. I think I've had four deaths on this and five death, two deaths on the Cubs. Stupid trees. They come up so fast you can't see them. I think so. There's a help menu. Maybe I should look at the help next if I don't get it this time. August 20th. Ah, okay. Is that the game or the show?
true. I blew it up. Okay, we're gonna look at the help. Trying to rescue camp, she got trapped by the poacher's helicopter, now she's barely holding on the rope. Uh, if you can get the Comey under Eliza for just a few seconds, she could drop to safety. So I am doing it right, I'm just not doing it well enough. The game is uh, just awesome. I never watched any of the new ones. But I watched uh, Cartoon Network all the time in college. Because our dorm had cable. That was back before people could download videos. Ah, oh, come on, that wasn't hitting that. People could download music, but videos were just too big for the most part. The DVD uh, decoders didn't work too well either, so it's hard to rip your own. It's impossible! It's impossible to get it under her for a few seconds because a tree always comes up in the way in a few seconds. Oh yeah, VCD. I remember those. Where you had to have two or three CDs, usually two. And then you had to have a uh, player that could play VCDs. I still have my DVD player that will play VCDs and DivX files. I remember it was DivX specifically. It says it right on my uh, DVD player. Oh yeah, they were not good quality. Because, I mean, a DVD is, what, like, six times the quality of a CD? And you're trying to compress it into two CDs? It's just... it looked bad. There's no restart, unfortunately. I know I'm gonna lose. Can I just restart, please? It wasn't really. I don't remember commercial VCDs myself. I mean, if they came out before the ripped ones, then it was probably when I was in high school. I remember begging my parents for a DVD drive for our computer. Never got it though. Had to wait until college, and I had to save up for it. It was like 160 bucks for a DVD drive. And that was just one that would play DVDs, not even burn them. These trees are in my way. Okay, if you slow down and so you don't crash into a tree, you get to keep your speed. It's so hard to dodge these things though, they just go, they come up too fast. Well, this is definitely different than the other Thornberries game. The other Thornberry's game was horrible platforming. Yeah, they are better magnetic. But 
course, stopping for every tree makes it so you can't catch up. and get hit the other. Like an input delay too. Where this is impossible. Will they even test this? So far, this level is hard. It's a mini game game, so I'm sure there will be future games that are future levels that are easy. The cub one was pretty easy. This one you're supposed to be underneath her for three seconds. The trees come every three seconds. Too many... Too many trees. He's pretty chill about his daughter getting kidnapped. That's Nigel for you. Oh, come on. Just sprinkle too many trees. Wait, are there no trees on the top? Ever? I think I may have found the cheese. There's no trees on the top ever. Bushes, but no trees. Seriously. How long do you have to wait? As long as I don't cut the cheese, yeah. Well, now that I found the cheese, I should be able to do this pretty quickly. No, there's no button. It would have been explained in the directions. There's A to go, B to stop. Okay. Pretty much lost already. There is a tree at the top. How much for the cheese? Thought I found the cheese. If you go to help, it says blah blah blah. Press the A button to speed up the COM V. B button will act as a brake. That's all. Those are the only directions they give you. Stand under her for a few seconds. A to go, B to slow down. Just kind of blend with the background too. Son of a That's it. Can't get her now. 
Bye, Eliza. Enjoy your new home with the poachers. This, yeah. I can't believe they put this one as level 2. Seems like they should have put this one at higher. But I guess they have to go movie order, don't they? This is what happened in the movie. And you have to stay boosted under her? Oh my god, this is so hard. Even when I can get up to her. Yes! Finally! Woo! I did it. One monkey symbol WC. What is that supposed to be? A T? That's a weird symbol. Next. Okay, Darwin's Dilemma. With their cheetah poaching scheme foiled, the poachers have now tranquilized the leopard mother and are going after her cubs. Thankfully, Darwin is at hand, defending his baby leopards with a ready supply of pineapples to knock down the climbing poachers. You know, I think I've seen this movie. Windings and passwords should be crime. Exactly. Use the A button to pick up and throw pineapples. Use the A button to pick up the baby leopards if they get too close to wandering off. This is a cute mini game. Meow. Take that pineapple. I like that it prioritizes the pineapple too if you're trying to pick stuff up. They definitely tested this game. It looks kind of gross though. I feel like the graphics department probably could have done a better job. I did it! NZ03. Um, I don't think she was sent to boarding school. Debbie and her parents survived, saved Eliza from harm, then they worried. They worried the Serengeti was no place for a young girl. Her parents decided to send Eliza to Mrs. Beecher's school for ladies in England, where Grand Mumsy Thornsbury could watch out for her. Eliza was sad to leave her best friend, Darwin, and the other animals, but things really got wild when she arrived at school. Check the mini games, a puzzle new mini game awaits for you. Level 4 The Search for Darwin. Darwin's been locked up in a London boarding school. Eliza must sneak through the school while avoiding security guards to find several keys to open the horse stall where Darwin is being kept. The A button lets you open up and hide inside the lockers or hide behind the columns. Lockers or columns. Ooh. Oh, so that weird number is a nine. I don't know where I'm supposed to hide. Okay, so I just gotta find Darwin, right? Open the horse stall. Okay. Find several keys to open the horse stall where Darwin's being kept. Those have those are color coded. They're probably locked. 
Nothing in here. How you doing, Carl? Rose here. How's it going? Oops. Come on, Key, where are you? Yeah, it's really hot in Texas. Oops. Oh, the guards just hit you, I guess. They're pretty easy to dodge. Seems like it's more of a race against time. Oops. Unless there are more stairs up, this is the top floor. I haven't found any keys yet. I think I already looked in here. Cards are really easy to dodge. E on stairs. This should be dead end then. Now there's like no reason to hide for any reason. There's the blue key. So, pretty sure I know where the blue door is. I think it's over here. Green key. I think it's on the next level. Oops. Actually, it might be further this way. Level was further this way. Oh, I think the green key was down below. Door, there it is. And there's another green key. I don't remember this color door. right my way. That's the last one. Oh no, it's not. I'm just in a different section. <laughs> I just ran right by him. We're looking for a cyan key now. But I could hide behind pots. I don't know. Nothing up here. Must have been time. Purple. Yeah. Cyan on the top floor, purple on the second to top floor. Is that a un unlocked door over here? Buzz. There's purple. Are there any more doors on this level? Hey, a bulletin board. Can't read it. This is the most thrilling minigame. Watch me get keys and open doors. This is still better than the other Wild Thornberries game. Red key. I've not seen a red door yet. I'm gonna go down from here. Nothing else on this floor. Empty room. Nothing in here. I feel like I'm on the bottom floor. 
And there's the red door. Sign key. We can go all the way up. And hopefully this is the last one. Well, it gives me another key though. Okay, I thought there was a... Hey, Mo! Mo with the host. This is what I get for streaming daytime. I have to put up with Mo. <laughs> How you doing, Mo? There it is. Yellow key. I've not seen a yellow door yet. Hey, Mag. How you doing, Mag? Get the sharp emotes. Is probably at the very bottom on the right, I would imagine. Oh no, it's right here. Or on the very bottom. There's more. There's more. Uh, yeah, I forgot the timer. Sorry about that. I always forget the timer. Let's see, we got 30 minutes almost exactly since I started. Forgets exactly. Hey, I found him. You did it. That's where it is. R1B9. Escape from school. Guess that's next. Can't go here. I have to escape from school first. Right. Eliza has found Darwin, but now she has to escape from the school. Help Eliza and Darwin make their way through the maze of the school grounds. Find a way out. Yay, a maze! Yeah, this is the minigame one, which is the Wild Thornberries movie. There's a platformer one that has horrible graphics. And that's the other one. The Wild Thornberries. Chimp Chase, I think it's called. And the B button lets you get onto or get off the bicycle. This is just a maze. Do I need a blue key? Guess I need to find a blue key. Ow. Speed. There's a yellow key. But I need a red key to get the yellow key. Yay! That's basically a top down version of what I just did. Should I, be, should I care about my monkey? I feel like I should care about my monkey. Uh, the movie did come out before this game. This, the plot is pretty much following the movie. There's the blue key. not a key in the maze, is there? Doesn't seem like it. Oh, there's the red key. There is a key in the maze. Red key will get me the yellow key. I guess I have to go down first. Get the red key. Hey, monkey. Should have gotten the red key when I was up there. Darn. Well, this must have unlocked something, right? No timer on this one. Need a green key. Hurt my thumb. 
GBA game is not very good about diagonal movement. Okay, I guess I have to get the red key. Because I haven't found a yellow door yet. Oh hey, a bike. It said me to get on the bike. I wanna get on the bike. Come on, get on the bike. Oh, the bike is yellow. Bike has a yellow seat, I probably need a yellow key. But I know how to get the yellow key. Still haven't found the green key though. Keys right there on the maze. Wait, red key is like completely blocked on all sides. Maybe that's what the uh. Bike is for? I get to the red key if I have the bike? Yeah, it's blocked on all sides. What the heck? Well, I knew it's up in the top section. Going down to the green door where the yellow key probably is. Ah, I was just trying to get the pedal. Where's if I don't need Darwin? I just don't know what those little white packages do. Going through a door? I heard a door open. Hey! That's why. Must be in here. Yellow door. Looks like the exit. Just need to get the yellow key. I mean, I know where the yellow key is. It's, I just don't know how to get the red key. I guess I have to go all the way back up. There's got to be a way to get the red key. Sure looks like it's blocked though. Maybe there's a hidden... There's hidden entrances in this thing. I think Darwin might follow my path, although slowly. He's coming up now. Ow. There's the hitbox on that. These levels are so much fun. It's got a yellow seat. You must need a yellow key for it. So, I must not need it to get the red key. Red key's in here. 
Aha, there was a secret. That's kind of lame. forget to implement it. It was even in the instructions. Then press B to get on the bike. Oh, you need him. Okay. Well, easy enough. to the end of the level. Like down here, wasn't it? Huh. Guess I'm getting off the bike. Don't leave Darwin in there. Okay. I did it. Shaman Mayambu spoke to Eliza in a dream. She headed back to the Serengeti plane with Darwin to stop something dreadful from taking place. But she never thought this would be a very a long and tedious task. The game is even telling me it's going to be long and tedious. Uh, it's time to see the mini games again. Slide into another mini game. No thanks. Next up, the Great Rhino Rescue. Eliza's on her way back to the Serengeti when, from her train, she sees poachers hunting some rhinos. Help Eliza get to the baggage car in the front of the train so that she can start grabbing luggage to throw at the poachers and disable their car. A button allows you to pick up and throw luggage. I mean, I can't do... Anything else? No rhino saved and one rhino caught, I think is what it says. Can't throw any more packages though. I don't get it. Hey Famicom, thank you for the follow. to go all the way back up again. I can't throw any more packages. I don't... I'm pressing A everywhere else. Now I've got one. I guess I only get so many... This one... Must have something to do with the guard. Maybe I can only pick him up if the guard's not there. is not good. Not horrible, but not good. It's a mini game game, so some are okay, some are not okay. All in all, I'd probably give this one a two if nothing else changes. Help Eliza get to the baggage car in the front of the train. 
because she can start grabbing luggage to throw at the... A allows you to pick up and throw luggage. Maybe I just have to go all the way... Oh, I pick up the luggage from the front of the train. I see. I have to press A. Okay. I just didn't read the directions. Yeah, that's right. I got luggage. I thought it said pick up luggage at the back of the train. Run faster. Art doesn't seem to do anything. there. Yeah, no. Can't use the crates. You can only use the luggage, which is not crates, even though it looks like crates. Oh. I can't throw when the guard's on top of me. So it does do something. Only when he's, like, right on top of me. Yeah, the open coal container. Exactly. Oh, might lose one here. Nope, they're pretty far ahead. wasn't too bad, once I figured out what I was doing. Yeah, they were not lying about the tedium. Debbie's Wild Race. Back in the Serengeti, Debbie and Boho need to get to the Thornberry's camp quickly before it gets dark. Debbie has found the perfect solution to get there in time, a motorbike. Racing through the jungle may seem like fun, but it'll take some quick reflexes to get this rickety thing through the jungle in one piece. Pushing the A button will cause the bike to speed up, B to add brake. It's a different racing game. I like that they just didn't reuse the last one. about not seeing what's coming. <laughs> this is ridiculous. It goes so fast, but then you can't see what's coming. Yeah, I'm about to die. Oh, 
Okay. At least they give you plenty of time. And it's even got a progress indicator on the left there. This is not a fun game. Mini game. Another checkpoint? Made it. Well, that was quick. At least. FC6P. Meanwhile, Eliza wandered the forest with Darwin and Donnie, searching for her parents and Tally. Something terrible was about to happen on the other side of Tembo Valley. If I mention the minigames, you'll be amazed at this new game. Amazed. Okay, so we got Lost in the Jungle. We got at least three more minigames. Yeah, I see that. I've see, been, been seeing you posting a lot of progress. You're at, what, over 400 games now? Lost in the Jungle. Eliza... Donnie and Darwin must work their way through the jungle while avoiding the poachers who want to capture them. Unfortunately, the jungle is full of traps that block the way. You'll have to navigate Donnie, Darwin, and Eliza past these traps to escape. Tip, there is also a group of power-ups you can collect as you go along. Pay special attention to the bananas as you will need them to disable traps. Oh man, it's a maze game. I miss the gold, do I just have to find my way out? There's a banana. Oh, I used a banana to disable the trap, okay. Who are you? Oh, you're actually trying to hurt me. The bananas are like keys. Seems like I could just use one of those stones that's on the ground. Just doing the follow the wall strategy to the maze. friends today. Yeah, THQ has not had a very good run on this challenge. Mazes are fun. Famcom. Much appreciated. I'm looking forward to the next game though. Just Onimusha Tactics. Should be my last long game before I get to play Fun Fantasy. Mazes are fun. Thank you for the one bit. you do 25 bits, you trigger the text-to-speech, which is actually fun, unlike mazes. Oh, 
Well, that package gave me time. Weird. It's the two bananas. Oh, I guess it wasn't a package, it was a clock. The banana. Down there. Okay, monkey, I'm just gonna run right through you and not get hit. to work. Didn't it work before? That was weird. <sighs> hey, yeah, if you like the uh, Play All Games challenges, check out my team. My team, the, the Challengers. You can find a whole bunch more people that are doing the challenges. And there's also the Challenge Doc uh, that Sting keeps. I'll go ahead and link that as well. Here's the challenger stock. If you haven't seen it, there's a lot of good people on here. Including myself. Alright, back in the jungle. After the storm. A sudden storm has flooded a nearby river, washing a bunch of animals into waters. Using Darwin to, pad to paddle a raft, help Eliza scoop up the animals from the river, drop them off at the nearest pier for medical attention. An R button can be used to pick up animals from the river and drop them off at the pier. Oh, L and R. As far as left and right. I guess I have a maximum of 10. That I can hold. What's a pier? Where's the pier? I'm not seeing a pier. Oh, this is the pier. Guess I should get the ones closest to the. Uh... Hello. Oh, I see. They have to. Does it matter if they go off the waterfall? Oh, there's a timer. Yikes. Wacky races. I have a wacky stackers. I don't think I have a wacky racers. I know I'm timed, I should be able to get this done. The timer's going faster than one second each, though. Why are there so many animals stranded in the water? Oh, there's a pier there. And the time stops, slows down when I'm on the pier. That's weird. One, two, three. I swear that says 800. Oh, I get so much time. I think this game is bugged. Oh, three more, huh? Zero. Timer was weird on that one. But I did it. 399. 
Level 10, Eliza's Elephant Escapade. The poachers have laid a final trap. A final. An electrified fence. To capture the elephants heading toward the Tembo Valley, Eliza must destroy the electric fence. You must find the medallion pieces and reach the fence before the elephants. The butterfly will help you. Oh, how nice of that butterfly. I'm gonna follow the butterfly. There's a medallion piece. I hope I didn't miss one. Butterfly was supposed to help me. And I just got trampled. Oh. So I guess the butterfly is kind of a compass. There doesn't seem to be a timer, though. are beautiful. I love their white beady eyes. Ugh, oh, this girl runs so slow. I can't tell. I hope it's not pointing where I think it's pointing. Oh, I think we're going in circles. Spiral, I mean. Circle. Okay, I think the further away the butterfly is from me, the further away the pieces. I guess I got maybe two more pieces. Yeah, they make the levels a little too big. The maze levels are... eh. Like one more piece. Not sure why I'm collecting medallions, but I'm gonna go with it. Not sure why this sentient butterfly knows where all the medallion pieces are either. All right, can't she like talk to animals or something? Isn't that her thing? I don't know. I checked my audio the last time you said, and it wasn't. Have you tried refreshing? Oh no. I'll play explain before I touch the medallion. Elephants are gonna bite it. Yep. Lost that one. I can certainly check though after the stream. Anyone else having audio problems? Audio being out of sync. medallion is to bribe the poachers, maybe? Two second desync? Two seconds? Lord.
Keep money us way ahead. Hmm. fix it in post because I've got separate audio channels for recording. I don't want to mess with it halfway through. But thank you for pointing it out. I hope it didn't ha wasn't happening on the other games too. I guess I'm just going to have to check every single game. Watching me last night, Major. You know, was there a desync in the wrestling? desync today that wasn't here yesterday, even though I didn't change any settings. Kind of annoying how that happens. I'll double check it anyway. fans. So good, normal settings can't handle it. Yeah. Well, by the time this hits YouTube, there shouldn't be an auto sync. Desync. And I think this is the last mini game. Equinox. Auto desyncs already, so I have a I have a delay on my Elgato. Uh, usually the same between Game Boy Advance games. Did I miss this last one? I must have missed this last one. Same thing happened last time, too. Down here? Yeah. Get there before the elephants do. Yeah. I did it. Level 10B. As the elephant stampede continues, Liza must jump across the backs of the elephants to get to the lead elephant. Control pad, A to jump. Get to the lead elephant by jumping across the backs of other elephants. Hey, it's Frogger. Of course. Oh, I get hurt. I was like, why do I even need to use the elephants? I can just jump. Of course it's timed.
Hmm, this might be difficult. Thunder Alley took about an hour. It was a turd of a game, I think is what the phrase I used on the review. don't line up right. This is a minigame game. Don't line up. That's Frogger, but crappy. Exactly. Oh, now he's slow? What the heck? And now the other one's fast? What is... what? This is just random. cycle. Good. If you jump diagonally, you don't jump as far and it throws off the sink. I don't know if I can jump over crabs. I thought they were people. But yeah, I can see how they're crabs now. Getting a good cycle. Green is people. B 
people. Crabs are people too. Except they're not. Get there. Eat. One hit left. Gotta be getting close. That looks like the end. Yes! We did it! A 10C. <laughs> it's not over. The poachers are trying to escape. Eliza must find a way to stop them. Use the control pad to guide Eliza as she rides the lead elephant. Press the A button to raise the lead elephant's trunk. Stop the poachers in the by using. Stop the poachers in the by using the elephant's trunk to hit the helicopter. I think they didn't even proofread this. up here. There's no timer, so. There we go. Got him. Congratulations! Well done. Even soft ink. Alright, that's credits, and I can go as fast as I want on the credits, too. THQ credits. We are picking a new game. We're going to be picking game uh, 301. Wink, wink, wink. Okay, that's good enough. Beat the game. 116 minutes. That was a good daytime stream. We stopped the poachers. Good job, everyone. Alright, we go over to gilgatex.live. Thornberries. Finish game. Take completed today. Completion time. One sixteen twenty seven. Was a passable mini game game. I think I'm gonna give this one oh god, this one's really close. Between a 2 and a 3, 10 out of 10 would Elephant again. I think in the end I'm going to give it a 2. It's going to be a high 2 though. Challenge was a 2. I didn't really have to do much. Most of the games were either easy or boring. And a few fun ones. I don't really have much more to say about than that. Basketball minigame game, most of the games were either easy or boring, had a few fun ones. That's just about it.